Let's convert the decimal 0 0.52 to a fraction. So first off, let's call this 0 0.52 over 1. Since we're dividing by 1, we haven't changed the value, but now it looks a little more like a fraction. We need to get this 0 0.52 to a whole number. So what we can do, we have one, two decimal places. Two decimal places, we're going to multiply 0 0.52 by 100. So 100 times 0 0.52, that's 52. So now we have a whole number. But we can't just multiply the numerator by 100. We also have to multiply the denominator. 100 divided by 100, that's just 1. So we're only multiplying by 1. Again, we're not changing the value, just the way it's represented. 100 times 1, that is 100. So now we have our fraction, 52 over 100. That's the same thing as 0 0.52. But we can simplify this further. Let's give ourselves some room. So 52 and 100, they're even numbers. Let's divide both of them by 2. 52 divided by 2, that's 26. 100 by 2 is 50. We can still simplify this further, though, because these are both even numbers. 26 divided by 2 is 13. 50 divided by 2, that's 25. We can't reduce this any further. So if you take 13 and divide it by 25, or 26 by 50, or 52 by 100, you're going to get the decimal 0 0.52. It's just that we've changed these to fraction form. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.